My name is Priya Aurora and my pronouns are they and them or she and her. My passion is writing. I moved to New York City about seven years ago for grad school and here I found a whole world of activism in the South Asian LGBTQ community. I founded just last year in January a podcast for South Asian LGBTQ people called Queering Daisy. And it's a platform where we talk to South Asian LGBTQ people from around the world. Visibility and representation is just not something you see, especially as a person of color, especially as a South Asian queer person. And so I just felt like our narratives needed to be uplifted in a way that wasn't always centered around our queerness or transness, but it was about all the amazing things that we do in the world. So we're talking to chefs and artists and writers and directors and, and hearing all of the wonderful things they're doing. Find your truth to me means every day waking up and finding a way to be my most authentic self. And there's not a lot of spaces where queer folks feel safe or comfortable. And so finding my truth, I think every day means coming into my own, finding my center and making sure that not only am I safe in the world, but that wherever I go, I carry that authenticity with me. And I think a platform like Queering Daisy helps find your truth because you're uplifting stories as you know them and as you live them. And we tell you that that's okay. And I think a lot of queer folks don't often hear that. Recently, my style has really come into my own as, as a non-binary person and being masculine of center, finding comfort in typically masculine clothing, tuxes, bow ties, typically the formal wear, but formal that really makes me feel comfortable and reassured that I can be who I am. The Macy's service of personal stylist and having a personal shopper that embraces who I am and is open to giving me free advice on how I can be my most authentic self on the outside and, and reflect how I feel on the inside is really important to me to be able to feel safe, comfortable with my body, with my gender identity and expression. If I wanted to walk in and get a suit or walk in and get a bow tie, I know that that personal stylist is going to be right there with me wanting to help me feel my best. I think I'm most confident when I'm talking to people about their stories. I think when folks come to me and they, they've seen my journey or they know who I am and they want to share their truth, it really reinforces that the work that I'm doing is important because that avenue still doesn't exist for a lot of people. I also feel really self-confident when I find the perfect bow tie. Um, it makes me so happy to have that little flair of my own style in any kind of setting. I think what can get in the way for folks that are trying to find their own truths is society overall. Ironically, while we're all trying to seek that, that authenticity, we can kind of, as a society, lay expectations on folks. So whether it's a gender binary or in the South Asian culture, a lot of expectations around gender roles and stereotypes of, of what you're supposed to do as a woman or a man in a household or as even a child, those things can restrict us. And I think the more we're open to the possibilities of each person being who they are, the less so we'll try to impose some of these expectations on, on who we expect them to be. Being embraced by a big brand like Macy's is really important. It's something that I never thought was possible growing up. It feels like a big hug. But also just walking down 34th Street here in New York City, seeing Macy's always year round kind of encourage all identities and all gender presentations and all ethnicities and races. Um, I've always felt comfortable walking into a Macy's, especially this one, especially coming into my own gender identity. Uh, how I feel in my clothing is really important to me. So finding brands like Macy's that really embrace our communities and make the effort to, to make sure that we are able to be our most authentic selves is really important and really exciting and gives me hope for the future.